Hi guys, Alex here from Drayton's who have got Seat Leon 1.2 TSI SE Dynamic Technology finished in Bohem Purple Metallic Paint. All the wheels and tyres are in good condition. These are 17 inch dynamic alloy wheels. I really like the colour of this purple, you don't see it that often. It's nice understated but it's definitely purple. At the back you get a decent sized boot, uh, there's a slight bit of underfloor storage um, either side uh, of where the tyre repair kit is, so you can fit a bit of stuff in there, um, but it is a nice large boot and those back seats will fold down if you need any extra space in there as well. This car has got MOT until the 27th of the 2nd 2023 and we'll come with a full service history. Inside we have these cloth seats, uh, decent bolsters on the side and the base to keep them in place um, and they are very very comfortable, nice and supportive on the back. That continues to the rear with the exception of the central seat which is just uh, standard black cloth. Up front you've got a uh, rev counter on the left, speedo on the right and your digital screen in the centre, currently showing a digital speedo. We do also have various other things like average speed, uh, fuel range, uh, travel time, things like that. can also change what is on there as well. You've also got your assist systems, so you've got front assist um, on there, you've got your nav tab, your audio, your phone and your vehicle status, so any um, warnings or issues with the car will come up on here, so as you can see uh, I do need to replace the key battery, um, but there's nothing else on there, um, so if you've got a bulb out or um, any faults or anything like that, they will all be on there. On the main screen we've got a uh, touchscreen system. You've got DAB, FM, AM radio. You've got uh, your home button here on the top left. You've also got Bluetooth connectivity for phone and music as well as an aux input. And you have uh, colour sat nav. It's a nice easy sat nav system to use. Pop in your destination on the top right um, and off you go. You can also change the, um, the view of it as well. So if you want a slightly different view you can have that. But it's, yeah, it's an easy sat nav system to use. It's nicely up to date as well. Got your traffic tab on here as well, so you will get live traffic updates on there. And then your Bluetooth for your phone, and we have your vehicle settings on here. So you've got your short term, long term memory, trip computer. Uh, you've also got your parking and manoeuvring stuff on here as well. So you can change the turn volume of the rear parking sensors. It does only have rear parking sensors, um, but it's quite an easy car to sort of judge the size. Um, it's not too big and it's not tiny either, um, but it's quite easy to judge. Um, and once you're used to it, uh, you don't really need any more uh, than just the rear sensors. Uh, we've got your service details on here as well, so that will that tells you when your next service is due. You will get a reminder close to the time, whether that be due to the mileage or the um, actual time period. As I mentioned, you can change what is on your instrument cluster on your driver's display as well, just by ticking or crossing off those boxes. Moving down, down here we've got your engine start stop, you've also got your air condition controls, you've got single zone climate control system, so you've got uh, your temperature, fan speed and your directional controls as well. You've got a nice six speed manual gearbox, uh, it's nice and got a nice sporty feel to it. The throw between each gear isn't too big, um, so you can get through the gears quite well, um, it's a nice easy gearbox to use. Uh, you've also got an electronic parking brake and a hill hold assist there as well, so there's a little storage area there, under there. A uh, couple of cup holders, 12 volt socket and some more storage in this central console here. Also got a decent sized glove box with the CD player located in there as well. Moving on to the steering wheel, uh, you've got quite a sporty steering wheel, it's not too big. Um, the actual width of the steering wheel itself um, is quite small so it's not the sportiest of steering wheels but it does look um, nice and sporty, nice and clean. Um, on the left hand side you've got your track skip or radio skip controls with the volume and your hands free and on the right hand cluster you've got your selection buttons for the driver's display with your tabs either side and to select it's just pressing down the um, central roller there. You also have cruise control which is just on there, you activate it by that as you can see bottom left it's been activated um, and then you set it just with the uh, toggles on the end of the switch there up and down. 
and you also have rain sensor wipers your lights toggle is down there and you've got heated and electrically adjustable wing mirrors as well door pockets are a pretty good size in the front and as I mentioned at the back you do still get the cloth seats you've got um, air vent control there as well storage behind the front two seats and again decent door pockets at the back too it's a great car for young or new drivers um, due to the insurance being lower it's only a small engine um, and it's a nice little gearbox as well it's quite fun to drive even if you just need a car for uh, pottering around town or something like that it does work work well for that and it manages well on the motorway as well so kind of a good all-rounder it will come with six months gold cover warranty which can be extended for as little as 199 pounds for an extra six months we also have a range of finance options available so if finance is something you're looking for then we can help you out with that as well if you need any more information on this car or any of the cars we have in stock please go to drayton's.co.uk thank you